All right, looking down range, what do we have? Sideways targets. Sideways targets, right, because people are three-dimensional. <clears throat> this is a pretty decent representation of the side profile of a 140-pound man who's in pretty decent shape. Maybe he's a marathon runner. Uh, are people sometimes thicker than this when they turn sideways? Yeah. Now, would you consider this to kind of be a worst-case scenario for the thickness of a person from the, from the flank? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, I would say so. That's a thin guy. But can you ever find yourself in a situation where you need to use force and this is what you get? Yep. Yeah. What are some possibilities on that? Active shooter. Third party. Defense of a third party will be a pretty common one. You come into a situation where this guy's already actively engaging another person. He's about to engage another person. Or you issue a command and he turns like this. For whatever reason. Can you shoot a fleeing violent felon? Yes. 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 Maybe. What's Georgia say about that with uh, citizens? We can't. Violent felon's a violent felon, right? Yep. That's what I thought. So where are vitals from the flank? Obviously the head's still the head. A good point of aim is the ear. You're gonna get into there to that pons, that midbrain, that medulla oblongata, shut down the thought process and, and hit the uh, off switch. Obviously the head from the side, depending on the shape of their skull, might be a little bigger, might be a little smaller. Our upper thoracic cavity from the side, where are the vitals? Armpit. Deltoid. Deltoid to shoulder, be a good, uh, good point of reference. Uh, armpit, visual reference the armpit. Um, the heart is just as deep as it is wide, if that makes sense. It does take up a lot of the chest cavity, so if you had to get a good, really good flank shot, you have just a good chance of hitting the heart from the side as you do from the front. Unfortunately, your margin of error is less because of the width of the target or the threat. The bleed out on your heart will be faster. Yeah, the, the bleed out would be faster from a side hit. Um, and obviously, bleed out rates are going to be academic if you're in a gunfight because of the nature of the situation. Uh, but most people, when they start to assanguinate, they, they start to rethink their life choices. Uh, they may just go ahead and lay it down and uh, wait for the end, or they may uh, give up so they can get medical assistance immediately. Um, are there any other concerns with a flank target? Missing. Obviously, smaller target area. Here's the largest concern that I that I would consider besides the size of our besides of our target area is their ability to move is going to be in a direction that complicates shooting them. Whereas if they're flanked and squared off to you, their immediate movement options are forward or back, or they turn to flank, run left or right. If they're already flanked, prudence dictates they're probably going to move forward if they're going to move. They might re move rearward because people do unpredictable things in gunfights. Uh, but obviously a flank target moving left to right from your perspective is going to be much harder to hit. So that's where fire discipline comes into play. If you can't hit it, don't shoot at it. Does anybody disagree with that? We don't want to just put a bunch of at rounds down range and hope they hit what we're aiming at, right? Everybody here has got really good fire to discipline so far, so I'm not really worried about that. What we're going to do now, just to start with, is we're going to run a static drill so just so you guys can get comfortable with the flank shot as a point of aim, and then we're going to work in traversing movement. You're going to move on a flank target. Why? Because I can't make the target move. Everybody good with that? All right, go ahead, lock and load in place. That's going to be your right. point of aim from the start. Get that gun up! Cover and scan! Scan, scan! One more time! All right! Kneeling! Hit him! Recover! Safe, let him hang! Everybody go check your ass. I'll take it. Yeah, I had a pretty small target. 
okay with it. Yeah, I do with it. Could be tighter. Could be tighter, but you did good service. I'd say. And on the other side of the coin, a wider shot group hits more organs. As long as it's on the target, I don't care how far it works. As long as it's in the vital area. If you want to improve it, keep working on that trigger. Oh, totally know where the thing what do you think? Really hitting, yeah. It's okay. Yours is blowing around a little bit. Oh, and your iron's on it, too. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, nice. Iron's on a short gun are tough. Yeah. 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 yeah it's all right. I mean, I can hit, hit what I'm aiming at. If, you know. Definitely ain't my red dot. <laughs> I mean, you're hitting. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, that works. Move it up a little bit, but yeah. other than that, I mean, you got good, consistent area grouping. It's high accuracy. It's not high precision. Right. Cool. Uh, I can do it uh, if you give me a hundred rounds and a hundred tries. Um, give me a I get forty-five be, grain uh, wad cutter. Yeah, and I get to be close. Or forty-five. Or a Hotchkiss gun. All right. So here's what we're going to do now. We're going to move back to where we were, actually right about here. We're going to do traversing movement. I'm going to take you guys down one at a time. We're going to start on the first target, and as you move, as you lose the ability to traverse and hit that target, you move to the next. So you're going to shoot every single target here. So if you haven't tactically reloaded, now might be a good time to do so, because you're going to run out of ammo. I would like to see each target serviced at least three times. Like Lucky you! So I saw that. So close. Yeah. You want to tell me to do it? Yeah. Lucky you. I like how you phrase that. What? Service the targets. Service the targets. <laughs> Thanks, it. <laughs> 